Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue with Valorant where your update is keep on stucking at some percentage either it is 0, 45, 99 or even at 100 percent. So let's go ahead and proceed directly with the resolution. In the basic step, right click on your right client and choose option properties. Click on the compatibility tab and check mark both these options. Run this program as an administrator and disable full screen optimization. Once you check mark both these options, hit apply and OK button. Now go ahead and launch your ROID client and try to update your game again and check if Valorant is started to update or not. If this also failed, let's proceed with the second step. If you have installed any third party antivirus such as Avast or AVG, I highly recommend you to go ahead and disable both these antiviruses, Avast as well as AVG because both these antiviruses are creating issues with Valorant and in turn blocking the update of your ROID client. So go ahead, disable both these antiviruses and again try to update your ROID client. Now let's proceed with the third step. Click on the start menu and type Windows. Click on the option Windows Security. Here, click on the option Firewall and Network Protection. Click on the option Allow an app through Firewall. And here, click on the option Change Settings. Now click on the option allow another app. From here you need to add three files of the Valorant. So click on the browse option and here open the directory of your ROID client which is C drive, ROID games, ROID client and ROID client services. Double click it and click on the option add. Same way again hit the browse option C drive, ROID games, Valorant, live and valorant.exe file and thirdly is browse in this particular folder open shooter game binaries win64 and here is valorant win64 shipping double click it once you done click on the option add it is already in the list that's why it is not adding it you need to add these three files one by one once added you need to check mark both these options, private as well as public. Once check mark both the options, hit the OK button. Now close it, restart your PC and this will fix out the issue of Valorant update stuck or not downloading in your Windows PC. Now if all this method fails, let's proceed with the final step. First of all, make sure if Roid client or Vanguard is open in your system, you need to close it. Even from the system tray icon, if it is showing the system tray also, Close it. Nextly, right click on start menu and choose the option task manager. Here also press the V key to find any Valorant related processes. If Valorant is not available, press the R key also to make sure that ROID client or Valorant is not running in your system. Now close the task manager, click on the start menu and type CMD. Run CMD as an administrator. Type here SC delete vgc and hit the enter key now again type sc delete vgk and hit the enter key now here close the command prompt and make sure to restart your pc else this method will not work after restarting your pc head over to c drive program files and here you will find option of roit vanguard folder right click on it and choose the option delete as i have not restarted my pc you can see right over here that this file is in use and cannot be deleted. So make sure to restart your PC. After restarting, this Roit Vanguard folder will be completely deleted. After deleting this Roit Vanguard folder, again open C drive and here open Windows folder. Now in the search box, type VGK and hit the enter key. Here you will find a file with the name VGK boot status or DAT. Right click and choose option delete. Once this file is deleted, close it. Now open your ROID client again. Sign in. Once you sign in, it will show an option to update. Go ahead and click on the update option. Now you can see the update has started and this will completely update your Valorant and the stuck issue with Valorant will be completely fixed out. If this video works out for you, 
I request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.